glass ball light painting some of my tools item one 100 millimeter glass ball item two nice mirror nicely cleaned polished hopefully get rid of all dust marks on it makes it easier in editing later other items LED light sources bought from cheap one pound store lands modified so they're only giving out small amounts of light finger lights party favourites modified again so they're only giving out small amounts of light stuck on the end of old straws little sticks so I can easily control them and another one garden lights two or three pound this one changes colour stuck on the end of a stick first off place the glass ball on the mirror then we need to get the camera in focus go to live mode and of course focus on the surround of the uh, glass ball until you get a nice crisp clean edge so I want to set the camera to about a 6 second exposure on around f8 there should be more than plenty of time to get these type of photographs To avoid camera shake, I recommend either using a cable release or if you haven't got one of those, putting your camera onto mirror lockup for about two seconds. So when you start your exposure, it gives you two seconds before it starts taking pictures. Simply turn on the light, start the camera. Quick motions of the lines, nice smooth images then. As you can see I'm aiming slightly down on the ball from above getting a lot of the glass reflection from the mirror Fast movements will give you nicer straighter lines instead of slow movements. Slow moving, you'll end up with more jagged lines. Like that. Nice quick movements. If you're coming from the side, nice and quick, couple of movements, then bring the light source away from the ball. When you bring it away, try and hide the light at the end, so it's not shining on the glass anymore.
if you rotate the light while bringing it round the light appears and disappears giving a different effect And then of course you can mix lights. <laughs> 